Hello, welcome back to Persona 2, Innocent Sin. A lot happened. We got our personas investigating the Joker thing in which the Joker character knows who we are and hates our guts. And Ikichi's friends here have been completely forgotten by everyone. I can't believe Joker is real. But why does he want revenge on us? Um, about my real name. Could you keep it a secret from Boston, please? Ooh, that's v we'll be seeing kind of more of that looking stuff in Persona 3. My dream? I don't care anymore. It's not like it'll... I have to take over the family business, but why? Interesting, only one of them actually has a face. I wanted to be a doctor, but that'll never happen. I don't want to think anymore. Ken, you were going to be a boxing champ, right? I was going to cut a cool theme song for you. I'm sorry. And after I promised. If only I hadn't made you do that, damn it. Well, let's be on our way, shall we, guys? Wait a sec, Tetsuya. You're going after that guy, right? You should stay out of this. I'll deal with him. Well there, both of you. You're up against a real monster here. If we don't stick together, you'll die. Plus, we don't know where to start looking. Let's get someone else to do something about him. Like the police. Yeah, my brother is a police officer. Who'd believe us? We gotta arm up and kill that guy or we're all screwed. If that's the case, maybe I can help. I'll go see what I can find about Joker. While I do that, you should prepare to defend yourselves. That reminds me, rumor has it that the ramen shop in Kamea Alley sells weapons. Something about the owner being a former spy? With everything that's going on, why not start there? If rumors are coming true, it's worth a shot. Having just our personas makes me nervous. So to the ramen shop it is. I mean, you can pretty much carry this game with just the personas. She's got a point. Why don't we, st we don't stand a chance against him yet. We've both been called out on a grudge we know nothing about. Let's call a truce until that guy's out of the picture. We'll be safer if we stick close. Come on, Tatsuya. Let's chase him down together, okay? Um, eh, you're just repeating dialogue. Best overworld theme. Hell yeah. yeah. Hirasaka might seem a bit run down because of Cuss High, but it's not really that bad. The students there have settled down lately and I like this neighborhood's working class feel. I was like, Cuss High? Totally not my thing. But then lately they've been getting these hot guys. So now I want I go watch their shows at the prison. You're kind of cute too, but you're just seven students. Ha! Ah! I'm not a Cuss High student anymore. I used to be one, but no longer. Now I'm a, I am a washout who's fighting to study hard and make it into the best university in the country. However, the recent flux of women into this city is troubling. While I'm happy my alma mater is gaining popularity, they're distracting. I don't think there's attacks in the other rooms, which is nice. I don't know much about it, but there's some Joker game that's popular with the kids today, right? It grants any wish? Well, I doubt that. There's nothing wrong while with dreaming. You can focus on your troubles later once you're older. So we gotta go to... I guess the ramen shop?
Blah. Uh, okay. I ate the strawberry tubman. Now let's get down to business. Tadashi, a useless employee at the Kuzanua Detective Agency who dreams of hard-boiled exploits. Spoiled son of the Satomi Tadashi owner. And apparently the creator of the game. Director of the game. Mayam. I was a spy, but that was so long ago. I just run this ramen shop now. Why would I be selling weapons? Uh -huh. I heard from the chief and Tamaki that the secret dish is the password to getting an, an under-the-table deal. I must have just ordered the wrong thing. I heard it was something disgusting. What about the sweet red bean gyoza? Gyoza? That lady's always teasing her customers out of boredom. I've known her since I was a kid, so I'm pretty familiar with this place. And I know there's no way you can buy weapons here. Did he say secret dish, Tetsuya? That must be the password you need to buy weapons. Let's go ask the chief about uh, chief what it is. <laughs> She's pulling the wool over your eyes, kid. I can't believe you're falling for her wild stories. She used to be a spy, and I was her bodyguard. Now that's rich. <laughs> Man, what a surprise. Can't believe you can eat stuff like that. The city sure is a scary place. Huh. I'm a detective whose beat is the darkness of the city. Come to the Kuzunoa Detective Agency for your investigative needs. Here, take one of our flyers. Our offices are in Kamea Alley. Alley. What? You want weapons? You people too? I was actually the third wife of Arabian oil tycoon, so I don't sell weapons. Alright, to the dolphins. That thing scared me! What the hell is this? Ah, the protagonist of Shin Megami Tensei Yif. Welcome! Is there something we can help you with? Tamaki, a part-time worker at the agency. She attends a women's college and is an active devil summoner. She is dating Tadashi for some reason. Oh no, we just had a question. Can we see the chief detective? Uh, yeah, the, the rumors about the secret dish and the weapons dealing? You guys spread those just to tease Tadashi? We didn't spread them exactly. We just told him and Tadashi ran his big mouth. I knew it was something like that. Anyway, it's not like rumors can magically come true. Like Joker, he must have always existed. Can you give us any more details? We're investigating Joker too. He uh, he wants to kill us. How's that for info? I see. The unusual incidents and incidents lately would make more sense if rumors were indeed becoming reality. Chief Todoroki was once a dull third-rate detective, but has become suddenly brilliant lately. He does devil summoning work on the side. Well, do you want us to spread the rumor about what the secret dish is? Yeah, if the rumors are coming true, we can spread rumors that work in our favor. I'll do this one for free, but I'll need you to file an official request. Okie dokie. Spread rumors. The ramen shop owner is an ex-spy. She sells real weapons. I'll spread the rumor for you, for you gratis. If you, if it's the one you want, please. Anything else? Now we good. Go see for yourself. If the rumors come true, ordering banana char suey ramen should get you weapons. Okie dokie. 
I'm trying to talk to Lisa. I don't exactly have all four great directions here. Off to Shirishi, Shiraishi Ramen. Let's go see if the rumor came true. I'm sure it must have. Yeah, okay, I guess I'll walk around this way. Is this really necessary? Shouldn't we go after that guy instead of hanging out here? The rumors spread. Now just watch it unfold. Oh, but make sure that clown doesn't hear what the secret dish is, okay? Oh, there's the weapons in It worked! Alright, order up. You lost the game. Why me? One banana char sui ramen, ma'am. <laughs> I knew this day would come, Kichi. These weapons are on the house as a farewell gift. Hmm, let's see. Ikiji, you get a standard case. Mr. Cool here gets a... Misery Corday, and I'll throw in some leather gloves for the girl. But rules are rules. You have to eat what you ordered, or I'll pretend this never happened. There, I choked it down. Take that! Blech. Big news, everyone! I talked to someone who witnessed Principal Hanya with a mysterious masked figure. Hi, me. Really? I wonder if that's Joker. Let's go back to Seven, Tetsuya. Hanya might know something about Joker. I'll keep researching the relationship between Joker and, the ru and Rumors. from healing items. You always have that lighter with you, Tetsuya. I can understand cuss high guys carrying one, but you don't smoke. What's the deal? No one at my school smokes. I have a strict rule against it. The same goes for Ken, Shogo, and T Takeshi, too. Tum -ti -dum. <gasps> the song! I can't get out of my head! I make my living as a composer, but an artist's life is extremely tiring. The more I tap into my creative side, the more exhausted I get. Sometimes this causes me to see things that ordinary people can't. can't. Just this blue door to the velvet room. Hmm, that gives me an idea. Sister number five. Ah, oh, yes, welcome. Chewing souls immediately? Noise! Magazine enter sweepstakes, Cure's possession and mute, Cure's sleep charm, Fury Berserk, Poison, Bomb Life, that'll be all my money. Let's take three of these. And ten of these. Talk to sister number five. So what do you want to talk about? Let's make small town. <laughs> Our drugstore is making plans to branch out all over the country. We're starting with Sumuro City. Leave it to us seven Satomi sisters to brainwash, I mean take over this city. <laughs> Alright, back to seven sisters. Where can I save my game? How do I do that? Yeah, noise. Six one twenty twenty. Our last play, huh? Fifty two hours. Damn. Much longer than Persona One. Well, Persona One was also two playthroughs. Oh, we can finally look at our personas.
Roman God of Smithery, patron of artists and inv investors. See, what I like about this game, it tells you how close the Persona is to leveling up, which Persona 1 really needed. Arcana is Sun. Arcana is Death. This son of Zeus in Europa is one of the three judges of Hades. He uses water. Ah, oh, the first lover girl arcana. Lover arcana girl. Greek god presiding over love with magic arrows. Alright, two seven sisters. Cool looking city. Oh, don't you go to sevens? Did something happen at your school? It sounded like there was some commotion on the school grounds. Oh boy. Um, I hear a ramen shop sells guns and swords and stuff. I wonder if they have a really cool sword. Oh, speaking of which, is that actually equipped on us? Yes, okay. Guess what? You've noticed how this place is in islands surrounded by the, the Tantabata... Tanabata River, right? I was told it got its name because Ren Rengidai, whatever how you say it, means lotus flower. In the spring, it looks like a lotus floating on the water from above. The principal statue at Sevens doesn't like to be seen walking around, but there aren't many foxes around these days. Is it possible? Guess he hates foxes. I should probably stop this part, huh? Well, when we get in here. After this event. <laughs> the hell's going on? ay -ya. I wonder what's up. Did something happen? You could say that. The big clock in the tower suddenly started moving. Philemon's observing things. What's the matter? Why all this fuss over a clock starting? There's tons of scary rumors about this tower, like ghosts appearing and other bad stuff when the clock starts again. Oh no, what a terrible omen. Namu Amari Butsu, Name Butsu. Take it easy, Gramps. There's no need to be scared. Long as I'm around, you got nothing to worry about. No, something awful will happen. Before he died, that teacher said, the world will end if time is not stopped. Are you talking about that teacher who died in the clock tower? Yes, that's right. That teacher nobly sacrificed his life to save the children and ensure world peace. No, this can't be. The seven Pleiades set the frozen time free. Has it begun? <gasps> the Naru Naruato Stone. I want to say Naruto, but I don't think that's what it is. What about the stone? What's gotten into Miss Ideal? Can this day get any crazier? The big clock started again, so I'd say yes. Can we really prevent the curse by taking the emblems off our uniforms? What, what, what happened? Oh god, your face! The curse! It's the emblem curse!
Dude, what? Did that girl's face just... Okay, what's going on? Does this mean it isn't enough to take the emblems off our uniforms? Let's hurry and find Principal Hanya. We need to find... We need to lift the curse before my face and Tatsuya's gets all messed up. I mean, you got the right idea, but your priorities are a little longer. Ah, uh, the game can save anyway. Nice. I only use three save slots, but... Gonna kick that up to a higher number. Alright, stop this part here and we'll move on to the first dungeon of the game. Thanks for watching.